Hey there, smart shoppers. Welcome back to Buy Smart, your ultimate guide to making the best purchasing decisions. Today, we're diving into a 5G showdown between two budget-friendly titans, the Motorola Moto G 5G and the Samsung Galaxy A15 5G. Buckle up, because this is going to be one bumpy ride filled with laughs, facts, and maybe a few row sessions. Let's get started. All right, let's talk about the first thing everyone looks at, the price. The Moto G 5G will set you back $249. Not bad, right? But hold on to your wallets, folks. The Galaxy A15 5G swoops in at just $158. That's right, Samsung is practically giving this phone away. Maybe they're just trying to get rid of them. Who knows? Next up, the display. Moto G 5G boasts a 6.5-inch 120Hz display. That's smoother than a baby's bottom. Meanwhile, the Galaxy A15 5G offers a 6.5-inch Super AMOLED display with a 90Hz refresh rate. Sure, it's not as buttery, but it's got those vibrant colors that make you want to lick the screen. Just me? Okay, moving on. Now, let's talk cameras. The Moto G 5G rocks an advanced 48 megapixels camera system, complete with a dedicated macro vision lens for those close-up shots of whatever tiny things you're photographing. On the flip side, the Galaxy A15 5G brings out the big guns with a 50 megapixels main camera, plus a couple of extra lenses just to show off. And let's not forget the 13 megapixels front camera for those all-important selfies. Moto, you might want to step up your selfie game. Under the hood, the Moto G 5G is powered by the Snapdragon 480 plus 5G processor. It's like the little engine that could... almost. Meanwhile, the Galaxy A15 5G flexes with a MediaTek Dimensity 6100 Plus processor. It sounds fancy and it's got the numbers to back it up. Plus, with 128 gigabytes storage and six gigabytes RAM, you can hoard all the memes you want. Battery life is crucial, especially for those of us who forget to charge overnight. Both phones come with a massive 5,000 milliamp hours battery. But here's the kicker. Moto G 5G promises 5G-friendly battery life. What does that even mean? Is it battery life with a side of fries? Meanwhile, Samsung's battery is just there, doing its job. And oh, Samsung, where's my charger? You sold it separately? Classic. Connectivity is next, Moto G 5G is compatible with almost every US carrier you can think of, including prepaid ones. It's like the social butterfly of phones. The Galaxy A15 5G, on the other hand, is an international model with no US warranty. So if it breaks, you might need a plane ticket. But hey, it's got dual SIM slots for all your secret identities. Amazon reviewers have shared their thoughts on both phones the Moto G 5G is praised for its smooth performance, bright screen, fast fingerprint sensor, NFC for Google Pay, stylish design, and overall value for money. On the other hand, the Samsung Galaxy A15 5G is loved for its great screen, battery life, fast performance, and being a good economical option. However, some users faced issues with the charger and its compatibility in the USA. So there you have it, folks. The Moto G 5G and the Galaxy A15 5G go head-to-head -head in a battle of budget 5G phones. Whether you're Team Moto or Team Samsung, both phones offer great value for their price. Just remember, if you choose the Galaxy A15, you might need to invest in a charger. Dot? and possibly a warranty. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a comparison. 
drop a comment below and let us know which phone you'd pick and why. Until next time, stay smart shoppers. Product links are in the description.